Good morning. The shots. Yeah, people are starting to get them now. In Sweden it's starting in January. In the UK it's starting today actually. In the United States 20 million people will have gotten it in December. It already started in Russia. So, I talked to a guy, yeah, Swedish guy. He said he will willingly take it. He will be happy to. And I asked him some questions. I asked him, you know that you can't sue them. If there are side effects, you can't sue them. You know this, right? He didn't know. And then he said, well, I'm sure it's all right. See, there will be no problems. They wouldn't give it if it wasn't safe. So. And I asked him, you know, this was developed in within a year. And normally it takes like eight to ten years. And he said, yeah, he knew this. But then he said, well, they have been working very hard on this. It's, it was urgent, you see. So, I'm sure it's all right. <laughs> and I started to get this idea in my mind about people in general who are so happily taking this and I will say it again I will not feel sorry for you if there are problems with this I will not no there are so many observations to be made you know and I actually thought about this book that I read again recently 1984 by George Orwell I'm sure many of you read this book anyway it's a big brother one of the goals is to have people doubt their own observations. So if you, if you watch a t-shirt and you say, yeah, this is a blue t-shirt, and then the authorities will say, it's red, you will start to doubt it. You see, you will start, maybe it is red, you see. I see, this is what's going on here. Yeah. Or something like it. It's very, clo it's very close, isn't it? People... Uh, they have observation skills. These people, this guy that I was talking about, he's a bright guy. See, he's able to observe things, but he's just he just trusts the authorities here. Yeah, it's uh, fantastic, isn't it? And so, sort of sad. Yes, I read about the UK thing. So they have 800,000 doses. They expect more to come very soon. They are starting to give this to people today. Yeah. This thing must be transported and stored at nearly minus 100 degrees Fahrenheit. It also can be moved only four times. What is this thing? <laughs> yeah. So I know many of you will not take it. I will not take it. Not in a million years I will take it. So I congratulate myself and all the others who will not. Yeah. But I'm, I'm looking at the near, very near future. It, there's a possibility there will be chaos here very soon. Yes. When these side effects kick in and people start to get very, very upset. You know, they have been fooled. This was a flu. They used it as an excuse to close the societies down. People are, have been suffering. Yeah. And now this thing is coming and they are supposed to gladly accept it because it will be the end of the lockdowns maybe. You see? Possibly. So, when or if people start to understand this and if there are serious side effects there's going to be some chaos now the guys who have been pushing this like the Rockefellers they they don't care about people being upset it's they they want chaos right it's it's a good thing for them they can move in quicker to create the new world order so it's all good for them you see so it's going to be very interesting now the the very near future and now I'm thinking what is next when this is done what's next well they have to 
close down the internet. Yeah, they have to do something because people are waking up and they are talking to each other. They have to stop this somehow. And, you know, the World Economic Forum, they have been talking about a cyber, cyber attack. Yeah, but this could happen. You know, that German guy, I don't remember his name. He's like, like a villain from a James Bond movie. Yeah, it's perfect. And he's been talking about the cyber attack. Hmm. It was like a dream for him. Yeah, this could come. <laughs> yeah. So maybe that's what's going to happen. I think there is a possibility. Yeah. I know this. They have to do something about us. Yes. So we'll see. Maybe we are going back to the old days. Oh, when we meet in person. When we are writing letters to each other. See? Maybe. Right. Okay. Be good.